<laughs> hey guys, it's Ali. Welcome back to the channel. I guess this is a little bit of like an update from my last current household video for um, my lovely, my sweet, sweet family from <laughs> Richmond. Um, and I thought, you know, I, I want to do an update because some people were like, oop, okay, I'm lagging. Like, I'm like, I like a bitch. I don't know why this is happening. <laughs> but some people were um, asking, oh, no, 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 why are you getting yogurt? Wait. Oh my gosh, no. Okay, they ordered pepperoni pizza last night and I guess I forgot to put it <laughs> I forgot to put it in the fridge, but I don't want her I don't want Eleanor to just have a uh, cereal. I want her to have something else, but like she's I'm not gonna get into why I don't want her to make her own food right now. I'll get into that later. Um, but I want her to just make something herself. I guess she can make fruit salad. She's not um big on cooking, but I guess she'll do that. Um but like I was saying, I wanted to have like a little bit of um another update on the family, I guess, and um where everything's at. And obviously right now we're playing with Javier, but um in future episodes we'll definitely definitely play um with the other kids and speaking of javier he's up right now i'm not sure why he's up this early he loves to sleep late i don't know i'm gonna put him back to bed <laughs> i guess eleanor woke him up with all the ruckus in the kitchen oh my gosh poor javi just go back to bed <laughs> so um eleanor actually so okay first of all if you haven't watched my previous um richmond like current household update thing mm -hmm. please watch that because that's going to give you a little bit of info um as to like where i'm leaving off right now but essentially in that episode i talked about um javi getting a trailer and moving out of san maishuno and this he did so we're actually in this trailer in strangerville right now um i did get this off hello <laughs> oh my god I, I keep forgetting this is like a part of strangerville um I did get this off of Tumblr, I think, and I think it's on the gallery too, but I'll have this trailer linked below. I forget who made it, but I kind of tweaked it a little bit. I put Javi's truck over here, which I still need to get him his license. <laughs> um, he has a license, but when I moved him from San Maishuno, he lost his license. So now I got to get his license back. And then this is like um, their little outside area. This is where Javi grows his things that he sells. <laughs> um, this is uh, Eleanor's like, um, what is this? Like a flower raging table because she's actually um she's a florist which i actually didn't uh make her do this job i found out she was doing this like when like she moved in with hoffy and i was like that's literally so cool i love that um but sh she technically has work today but i want her i don't know why i paused that i want her to call in because she's actually sick okay there we go we're gonna call in sick to work she actually does have the flu and i don't know how hobby does not have it because he's just like chilling in bed like he loves to sleep in late um she's definitely more of an early bird that's for sure but she genuinely is sick she has the stumpy flu like here it's a severe cough from cold eleanor's throat is very itchy i know how that that stuff feels um but she's pretty much ready for the day i'm gonna have her get a shower really fast um so like i was saying um where we left off girl take a shower what do you mean i don't know why she's complaining um so like we left off um um, Javier got this trailer and he asked Eleanor to move in with him because they've been together for a couple years and it's he does love her he d let me just set this like the record straight uh, Javier is in like okay I won't say in love which we'll get into the tea Javier loves Eleanor very much and he was very much in love with her um but it's kind of like I don't know Javier's always had this like really big and deep like deep-rooted fear of commitment nobody knows where it comes from because their uh, his parents antonia and theo were like super close and they've been married for like decades so it's really confusing um but essentially javier was like okay well we've been together for a couple years i guess the next step i should take is to ask eleanor to move in with me um and the problem lies <laughs> in that okay so this is eleanor and they're essentially high school sweethearts as time went on in their relationship eleanor started to kind of be like okay when is he gonna propose like you know it got really serious like these two are just that have been together for so long and you know she kept hinting it towards javi and javi would always kind of like push it away or like be avoidant towards it and so they've gotten in many um oh my god <laughs> wicked whims they've gotten in a couple like a few arguments about this stuff um and eleanor is really wanting a deep deep commitment and she feels like javi by javi asking her to move in with him this is like the next step and she's actually feeling very very optimistic um whereas like she's not 
essentially seeing the big the biggest picture the full picture because javier did this yes because he loves her but also because he feels like oh naturally that should be the next step in our relationship because that's just how what people say um but this is Jaden. this is actually javier's uh uncle he said i have something important to tell you can i come over right now uh we're just gonna say no i mean it's a thursday morning um please don't <laughs> i think javier is needing a break today he's been he's been doing a lot of stuff he's been bouncing around and with the moving and stuff it's just been so hectic and chaotic and now he finally has his place and i love it i really do like i love his let's take a trip thing like he's such a big hippie um always i'm i'm not gonna glamorize anything but like he's into trying different things i will say that so that's definitely something i love about this man i mean javier like <laughs> he was such a surprise baby like i didn't i was not expecting him and he's just so so loved and so precious and i just feel so strongly for him um oh my gosh so many people are calling us hey son do you want to come see your dad <laughs> all of our family wants to see us today we actually we actually cannot we have some work to do today um i think he i don't know if he needs to water his plants no he doesn't okay well i guess he has a free day today but um if you guys don't know anything about base mental drugs the mod um essentially you can have your sim um sell uh, cannabis yes. and i will <laughs> let me let me reiterate this okay in strangerville cannabis is legal okay and stranger real cannabis is very much legal because like i said in my last video it's stranger real so everything's legal here <laughs> i'm literally telling you guys this game like makes me think of the weirdest things like how when in my right mind would i be like okay i'm gonna make this character and i'm gonna have him like live in like this trailer and i'm gonna have him sell things and i'm going to have him like do it like you know what i'm saying do you guys relate with me like that's just always how i feel but uh i don't know what are you cooking a faux blt sir you are not vegetarian i mean i guess that's fine i guess it doesn't matter i love how he like didn't even ask Eleanor if she wanted something to eat i don't know maybe he'd like assume that she's already eaten or something yeah so i guess that's the whole backstory so it's only been like a couple of days since they've moved in um and i do i was thinking about getting them a dog so i'm thinking about doing that today because they've been discussing that um for a while again that's like quote the next step right i want oh my gosh i totally forgot that you can make wedding bouquets that's so pretty i actually let's make a holly we make a holly arrangement that would be so nice unless she's oh is she too uncomfortable no ma'am no ma'am i'm sorry i really want you to make i really want her to make some flowers right now so let's make a holly arrangement and let's do that and that'll be super nice maybe we can keep it here or we can give it to um our best friend where is she marissa so if you guys didn't watch the last video as well um marissa is her best friend eleanor's best friend and they were actually roommates prior to Eleanor moving in with um, Javier. And so um, I said in the last video that Marissa actually doesn't really like Javier and she talks about that with Eleanor because um, Marissa wants the best for Eleanor because they're roommates and they're best friends and she really cares. Um, she really cares deeply for her friend and she sees sometimes um, the pain that Eleanor sometimes feels um, whenever you know she's had an argument with Javier because uh, like one of their arguments will go like, um, babe, like, did you, like Eleanor will be scrolling on on, um facebook or something or the equivalent of sims 4 facebook <laughs> and she'll be like babe like look like uh so and so got um engaged and javi will be like yeah that's cool and then um eleanor will be like so like when do you think we'll get engaged and it's like the same thing over and over which is like it's no fault to eleanor because i understand where she's coming from um but it's also no fault to javi because like javi wants what he wants and he doesn't want what he wants so now it's just a matter of like the thing is there's like there's conflicting like views here because eleanor thinks this is all happening because he's going to propose soon when that's not the case um <laughs> Raul Soros would like to come over to buy some weed. Is that okay? Yeah, sure. 
here. So um, Roel is actually part of our friend group. He's also Delaney's boyfriend, which was also mentioned. But here he is. Let's go ahead. I think we recently bought some from Milo, our friend Milo. Um, Milo's actually engaged and we're in the wedding party. So that's going to be fun. I'm, I'm not quite sure when they're going to have it. So I keep forgetting how to do this. Drugs weed sell cannabis um I, this can be definitely be like a base metal mod like or base metal drugs mod like showcase too because i love this mod it's so fun and so realistic look at them bro hugging i love them i literally forgot wait did they get matching tattoos <laughs> okay i'm going to only sell him one thing Ooh, cannabis is expensive here that's perfect yeah we definitely need to get to selling for sure um because i want them to be able to pay their bills um Raul said thank you so much you are the best of course my guy oh my god i want to talk to him um let's see maybe we can ask how delaney is back at the house back at the apartment um let's discuss interests i guess but essentially they are talking about like how's How's it back home? And Raw's like, yeah, Delaney's been mad at me recently. If you guys didn't see the last part, um, Delaney got pissed at Raul because Raul um went over to Delaney's apartment without asking. And they're not even moved in yet, which Raul's like really pushing it. So it's like so weird. It's like both the eldest Richmond kids are like having sort of similar relationship problems, whereas Delaney doesn't mind commitment. Delaney actually wants commitment. Delaney is just like kind of she's like scared because she's not feeling as strongly for a role, if that makes sense. Um, and her friend Taylor is in the mix and all that stuff because Delaney's by and whatnot. Oh my guy, why are you taking out the trash? Okay, well, anyways. Oh my gosh, look at this Holly arrangement she made. Eleanor, that is actually gorgeous. I do not mess with like um the floral arrangement stuff. I think this is part of seasons. I don't mess with it too much, but like when I do, I forget that I should do it way more. Like that's insane. Um, but it's only noon. <laughs> it's five it's noon o'clock somewhere. Am I right? No, please never say that again. I'm so sorry. I was an abomination to my channel. Um, but I'm gonna have him. Can he like lounge? Can he sit here? Sit, and then I'm going to have him um smoke uh some would would you say oh, medicinal Cooper. cbd no i'm just kidding <laughs> i just really oh why'd you get up man i really i just really don't want this my content to be taken down like i'm so paranoid like all the time um but he's gonna do that what is i keep forgetting what is miss girl doing she needs to Look nap that. um but speaking of eleanor eleanor has been a little sick lately and not just in like the flu way and like she's been a little she's had some morning sickness and um she's had like hot flashes and she's getting the, these like really weird cravings and she like doesn't know why and um she doesn't like she smokes with hot every now and then and she gets cravings when she does that but these are weird cravings like these are like you've never heard before like i'm just trying to think of one off the top of my head like carrots with peanut butter like she's just really craving carrots with peanut butter and she's like okay well i like carrots separately and i like peanut butter separately but not together this is really effing weird <laughs> definitely don't want to have her nap too long today though because like i said they are um going <laughs> they are going to go get a dog today um and i was thinking about and i was like should they go actually like go to the humane society or should they have um like look online and have somebody bring some dogs there and so they decided to bring some dogs here um also if you guys remember javi was like super big into soccer like he was so good in high school and in college until he dropped out so um and his like and tony and theo were so mad at him at first that he dropped out without telling them because he didn't tell them he didn't tell them for months and then they found out and then he was like oh shit and they were like why would you do that and and he was like um like he just didn't want to make them feel bad he didn't want to let them down he's so close with his family like he oh my gosh i love this sim so so dearly um but i okay so it is about two o'clock this day has gone by pretty fast it really has i feel like i've been talking a lot i need to take things a little slower you know let her sleep let how it is be um but uh while we're letting her sleep look at these like power outlets i mean 
I love these. These are so realistic. I forget where I get them, but um, I forget if they're custom con- I think they are custom content. Oh, you know what I do want to put in here? Okay, I'm not going to do it now because I have a lot of like, like NSFW things in my <laughs> in my build buy mode, but there's like a standing- um, oh sweet, she got paid. Um, there's a standing fan that came with um, these cables as well that I want to put in here to like add more realism, but um, this is the house. This is their- this is kind of like Javi's office where he does his office work. There's the bathroom and the kitchen. And here's the living room, which I freaking love. I just, I, I love it. It reminds me of a trailer that um I once knew of, if that makes sense. Um, I had a friend live there, but I think I loved this so much. Um, and I'm going to have Javi get his um license soon um and i'm not sure why he's wearing glasses because uh he wears contacts i'm not sure why that's happening so i hope he takes them off um but let's go ahead let's see if we can i'm gonna have um eleanor wake up real quick or i should have had him wake her up but i guess she set an alarm um they haven't even interacted today like even though they're having these problems like javi still loves this this girl so i'm gonna have him um embrace her really fast and then they're going to call over the humane society um i don't know what i would call them expert not expert they work there but you know what i mean so they're gonna say good morning or good afternoon how are you she's just been sick all day and then i'm going to oh i'm going to adopt a dog okay, here we are hiring a service um they're kissing behind i don't know why they did the mistletoe thing um it's literally spring it's literally so hot outside right now too but okay i'm gonna let I, I hate how it like the shadows peep through okay i would get a husky but there's two things here one it's strangerville and it's so hot and huskies are not meant to live in like heat and then two our little brother gabe has his own husky puppy like he just got it for christmas um from antonio and theo so we're gonna look at different ones i don't know if i like any of these there's a pomeranian okay now that i think about it though i feel like eleanor is going to convince javier to get a pomeranian and i don't think javier like really wanted a pomeranian but he wants a dog and he wants like to like make eleanor nor happy i guess to keep the peace not that he doesn't want um a pomeranian but i just i don't know i think a little pomeranian would be so cute and i really do think elnor was like convincing him so hard and i do think that they're gonna get another dog later on and a bigger dog but this is a boy pomeranian and his name is sumi um but i don't know i kind of want to name him something else so let's just see oh my god oh how the tables have turned okay period um but Raul's gonna go ahead and leave so but let's go ahead i don't know why he's playing soccer let's wait for uh the adoption service to get here or whatever i don't know why they're taking so long oh there he is sweet oh my god oh my god guys oh my god it's so much cuter than i expected god i keep forgetting i have this thing in my game this mod um let's do a friendly introduction i mean even if it's not exactly what javi wanted it's still so cute a little pomeranian puppy eleanor is definitely the type like she is so the type oh <gasps> Oh my god, it's mean. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I want to see if, if Eleanor... Oh my gosh, watch. Eleanor's gonna interact with it. She's gonna do a friendly introduction and watch it be nice to her. Oh my god, it's a devil puppy. Oh my god. Okay, I don't think we're gonna get this one. Wow. This was just not... Okay, you know what? We might end up going actually going to the humane society because i do not i'm sorry listen guys i'm all for adopting every single pet ever but like this is not good for reasons that i will explain later but like oh my god we can't have a dog like that in our house i do want the both of them i guess they're just gonna go to the humane society another day probably tomorrow or the next day that really that really sucks um but i think the two of them are going to uh visit the bar because they just moved and um it looks really it really does look super fun and javier's like a big bar junkie um he really likes to go bar hopping and whatnot so he's gonna go ahead and travel with eleanor they're going to go to the bar and he's never been here like i said so who knows who we're gonna meet or what we're gonna see i mean it's strangerville so holy shit i mean it's already crazy okay literally it was just a short walk like they live over here and all they had to do was walk over this way how awesome is that I really love that because even in San my shoe no they had to like it like tax season take the subway and i know you guys might be wondering okay didn't eleanor just have the flu why is she at a bar well apparently she's already recovered so <laughs> 
I like to think that like she just got over it, I guess. But she already has to use the bathroom. She has always been having to pee. And it's just the oddest thing. So, but I wish we could get, is there a bartender here? Okay, the bartender should be coming down now. So I'm gonna have them sit together. And Javier definitely wants, I, I don't know what he wants. He might get a shot. He might get some beer. I'm not sure. Um, But Eleanor is coming over to sit with him right now. She wanted to get done up. Of course she does. She always wants to get done up everywhere she goes. So Javier is going to order a beer for himself. Um, I think he's going to order some food too. Order some... What would she want? Because I know she's hungry. She's going to ask. I Or he's going to ask. I think she wants a uh, meat and cheese platter. That definitely sounds so good. Girl. No, I said meat and cheese. Um, And then after that, I do want him to order drink. And I don't know what he wants. Ooh, definitely a whiskey sour. He would definitely be the type to get a whiskey sour absolutely so she's gonna sit down and oh my gosh why is she sad <gasps> what does that say drifting love from jealousy caught the love of her life flirting with another are they joking around or losing interest okay i've been hating how this is happening this is happening very much autonomously um but let's just ignore that i'm going to have her ignore that girl stop it's not real it's not real guys just ignore that <laughs> i think maybe she's getting angry at the fact that um he's like or ordering like a whiskey sour um because i think he told eleanor a while ago that he would stop drinking liquor because it was like really um taking its toll on him and now she's like what the heck like why are you ordering a whiskey sour like this relationship is just so like weird because they love each other so much i mean javier like he loves this girl like this is his high school sweetheart but they're just they're kind of growing apart if that makes sense okay so i just had him order the drink and she's gonna order some food Ooh, that literally looks delicious oh my gosh that looks so good so javi's kind of asking eleanor like why aren't you usually order wine like what's up with you are you feeling okay and oh I was like i don't know i just you know i feel kind of sick like i feel like um like if i drink anything right now like i'll feel sicker and stuff like that and he's like that's really weird like are you okay because javi's really into fitness and health and so he wants to make sure that you know his girlfriend of his long-term girlfriend of years is okay and she's reassuring him like saying oh yeah i'm fine <gasps> but he's like no like it's kind of weird you know don't tell me that you know nothing's okay when you know and i think i think he was trying to joke but uh Eleanor took it the wrong way. I think she's actually really sensitive right now. Look at the... Oh my gosh, are those tears in her eyes? Oh my gosh, she's heartbroken. Oh my god, from a romantic compliment denied. I was telling them they had my heart, but it seems they wanted no part of it, whatever. I actually don't feel that that's the case. I feel like Eleanor is having mood swings. Oh my gosh, like this is insane. I really do feel like she's having mood swings. And you know what's funny is that she's been like, would it like laughing with the idea of like, oh, what if I was pregnant? But like, no, right? So marissa like was like oh my gosh what if you are so she kind of like convinced eleanor to oh my gosh just buy buy these tests at the dollar store just in case you know and she was like okay whatever i might need them one day and she actually has them in her purse and so she's thinking like all right well i need to excuse myself i'm just gonna go tell javi that i have to use the bathroom and so she's going to go to the bathroom wherever that may be okay we couldn't even use the bar bathroom because eleanor suddenly got like incredibly sick like six like she always does and she was like we need to go home we need to go home and they went home and she was like throwing up like a madman and everything so she's like okay i have to i just have to know so she's going to take a pregnancy test and i think um this is the first time i'm seeing her like this also this is underwear okay but oh my god are you pregnant oh my god oh my god <gasps> oh Okay, this just adds a completely new level to the story. A completely new level to their lives. Holy crap. Yes, guys, Eleanor is pregnant and she doesn't know what to do because if we go into her traits, you see this would be happy to have a child. The sim would love being pregnant and having a child, whether it's the right time or not. If a pregnancy happens, the sim will find joy in it. Totally fine, right? Now, if you look at Javi's, Javi's uh, trait, does not want a child right now. The sim is not interested in having a child as of now. If it were to happen, they would take it 
badly. Okay, so Eleanor is not quite sure how to really feel, like honestly. You can tell she's feeling uncomfortable, but look, she's happy. Uh, this little, what does that say? She's, oh my God, the flu came back. It says Eleanor wants children and is happy to know one is on their way, but Javi doesn't even know and she is terrified. So she's just gonna go sit down next to Javi and watch TV with him. Um, This is insane. Uh, This changes everything. Javi doesn't even know. He's said, <laughs> man doesn't have a clue in the world. He's like, you okay? Everything okay in there? You good? <laughs> he's like, yeah, I think it's just my flu or something. Like, I don't know. Maybe it's coming back or like whatever. And he's like, are you sure you don't need to get medicine? Like, we can take you to the hospital. And she's like, no, I'll be fine. So look at that. Not a clue in the world. Oh my gosh. You know what's hilarious is I actually did not anticipate this. I So one of the mods I have, um, it like offers like a chance of um conception through even just woohoo and i guess they woohooed a couple days ago and she got pregnant and she started like having these symptoms and i was like what is going on and i found i found out she was pregnant i was like oh my god so i was like this changes like i said this changes everything but i have to roll with it and look she's getting tired i feel like she's trying to avoid talking to him about it like oh, she's so scared I'm, I'm she will eventually i just really don't know how this is gonna work out but look at them they're sleeping together that's so cute. Okay, guys. Well, I guess this should be the perfect place to leave off. Um, Eleanor's pregnant. Javier doesn't know. And they are um, asleep on the couch. And Javier's probably drunk right now. So <laughs> um, let me know what you guys think. This is insane. It's crazy. Uh, shit happens. And we will figure it out from here, I guess. So um, I will see you guys soon. Bye.